Miss Linzer Cookie, your seat is right this way. Will there be any additional requests? No, thank you. Am I the last one to arrive? Some passengers have... No oh, oh <laughs> there they are! Mmm, this place is filled with the fine fragrance of grape juice. Ooh, now that's what I call good service. Dippity ho ho! You're so very right, my good sir. I have prepared a great selection of vintages for the tropical soda island's juices. Oh uh, yeah? Then what are we waiting for? Don't be home, my sir! But these are presents for the dear gnomes in the Cookie Kingdom. Esteemed passengers, everyone has gathered and supper will be served in a minute. In the meantime, isn't it an opportune moment to become properly acquainted? Acquainted? A brood is crumbling from hunger here! Besides, I bet every flatster around has heard about me a couple of times. He is not wrong. Schwartzfalder, is it? Now, stories of your, uh, deeds are quite famous where I come from. Then perhaps you also heard that I don't like to be called by that name! And who are you, Eddie? Ah, uh, I do have a rather packed schedule involving lengthy trips. Cheddar cheese cooking. And this is my rather troublesome colleague, Macaroni Cookie. <laughs> Nothing troublesome about me. You gotta look hard for a cookie as responsible and diligent. Are you two going to attend the famous holiday festival? The year's end festivities in our kingdom are very fun. Alas, the most fun thing that awaits us there is our layover. And then another train. Let us not get into, uh, further detail, Macaroni Cookie. <gasps> Such secrecy! I, for one, am looking forward to spending the tree lighting ceremony with Angel Cookie tonight. How I wish I could fly all the way to the top of the tree and touch the pretty star. Dibbity ho ho ho! I see the holiday spirit has already begun to spread. I have prepared wonderful gifts for all cookies, sugar gnomes, and cake hounds. It is a shame you must work during the holidays too, but it is you who makes this time of year all the merrier. I swear by my sugar beard, I won't stop until my candy cane cracks. Doopty ba do! Now that you mention it, your candy cane does look a bit worn. It's true. I have used this very same cane since the day I started working as a sugar gnome. And with me through thick and thin. You sugar gnomes always work so tirelessly. I admire you. <laughs> oh, but I'm not alone this time around. This chum here has a concert to prepare for. I, creme brulee cookie. Yes, the grand holiday concert in the Cookie Kingdom. I bet the entire kingdom will gather to see you perform. Uh, say, how do you keep your composure on stage? Tension helps with focus. Last thing I want the audience to see is me being relaxed. A cup of tea, please. Nice and hot. Right away, Miss Linzer Cookie. If I may, are you visiting the Cookie Kingdom for the holiday festivities? Or perhaps to work on your next book? I would neither confirm nor deny it. The mystery above the waves was fun. Fantastic, simply fantastic. I wonder what thrilling story you are preparing this time. Hmm? <laughs> you will find out soon enough. Seems like Conductor Royal Bear Jelly is a huge fan of Linzer Cookie's work. Why, I myself am an enjoyer of her Miss Waffle series. <sighs> Those novels are nothing like the cases we crack. Creme Brulee Cookie, where are you going? Supper is about to be served. All this talk about my concert only reminded me that I must practice more. I will grab a bite later. <laughs>